Well, the concern is misplaced because if you look at the statistics, African American voters are voting in just as high a percentage as Americans. A recent survey, 94% uh, of Americans thought it was easy to vote. Uh, this is not a problem. Now that was Wednesday. That was Senator Mitch McConnell making those comments during a news conference after two senators broke away from their party to change the Senate filibuster rules, making way for voting rights legislation. When asked what his message was for voters of color ahead of November's midterm election, McConnell responded by comparing African Americans to Americans. The comments drawing strong criticism from a number of people, including former state representative and current Senate candidate Charles Booker. And today in Louisville, his first public appearance since making the comments, Mitch McConnell addressing those comments, calling the backlash surrounding them offensive. This outrageous mischaracterization of my record as a result of leaving one word out inadvertently the other day, which I just now have supplied to you, uh, is deeply offensive. Senator McConnell was at the Gold House today with the Kentuckians for Better Transportation Conference. He says that while parties are divided on a lot of issues, transportation and infrastructure are some things Kentuckians agree need work. With $5 billion to spend over five years, McConnell has high hopes for a couple of projects in the state. But it may finally open up the opportunities to go forward with the I-69 bridge and the, and the Brent Smith bridge in ways that are less onerous than might have been uh, envisioned earlier. And I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. McConnell said he backs these infrastructure projects because instead of having to borrow more money from the federal government, they are largely funded already. Tension rising.